Hey YouTube, I felt like I had to make this video about my GoXLR and some buzzing I was having in my headphones. Um, it's a weird problem. A lot of people solve it with what they call a ground loop noise isolator. That didn't fix my problem and all the Googling in the world, um, I couldn't figure it out. I happened to fix it by chance, uh, so let me explain. First of all, I think it's important that you know how I set up my GoXLR. This problem with the buzzing in my headphones came from an external device being plugged in through the line in port of the GoXLR. In my case, this is a second PC that I use for streaming. To start things off, let's look at how I set up my GoXLR. My XLR condenser mic is wired into the XLR port on the back of the GoXLR. The line out from the GoXLR goes down into my streaming PC into the line in port of my streaming PC. I do this so that all the sounds from my gaming PC and my microphone go to my stream. Then I take the line out from my streaming PC and plug that into the line in of my GoXLR. I do this to get sounds like alerts from my stream and music because I do music from my streaming PC. The headphone out port on the back of the GoXLR, I use a 3.5 millimeter to 3.5 millimeter cable to go from that port to a ground loop noise isolator that's $10 on Amazon, and then from that ground loop noise isolator into the line in of my gaming PC. This allows me to use wireless headphones with the GoXLR. The ground loop noise isolator is necessary because when you are plugging in from the headphone out of the GoXLR to the line in of your gaming PC, it creates a ground loop and that creates noise. So you need the ground loop noise isolator for that. But I was actually having an issue with noise from another place and we'll get to that soon. You may have seen some videos out there that say that the only wireless headphones you can use are the SteelSeries Arctis Pro headset and the Astro A50s due to those two headphones having their own interface and they have an audio in, that's a 3.5 millimeter audio in jack that allows you to go from the headphones to the audio in of those interfaces. But this is not true. You can use any wireless headphone you want as long as you have that ground loop noise isolator and you go from the headphone jack to the line in of the back, on the back of your PC. After you do this, all you need to do is go into your sound settings, then click on the recording tab, select the line in audio option, click Properties, click on the Listen tab, check Listen to this device, and finally, select your headphones as the device to listen with. Also, while we're here, make sure that the chat mic audio source from the GoXLR is set as your default recording device. Now click on the Playback tab and make sure that chat is your default communications device and that system is your default playback device. Let's quickly look at the GoXLR app on my gaming PC and look at how I set up my routing. Let's talk about the inputs. The mic channel is for your microphone. The chat channel is for Discord. The music is for music. The game channel I am not using because the system channel gives me all my game sounds. The console channel works if you are using a digital audio cable from your console to the GoXLR. The line in is for anything you want to hear from on an outside source. System is system sounds, and finally, samples is your recordings using the sampler. Now, let's go over the outputs. The headphones is for your headphones. The broadcast mix is if you are streaming for, from a single PC. This is why mine are not checked. The line out is to send sound out to another device like a streaming PC. And the chat mic is an output specific for Discord or in-game chat. The sampler is for you to choose what inputs you record from like your microphone, your friends on Discord, funny stuff that you can only capture when you have it hooked up right. Now let's finally talk about the secondary buzz and where that's coming from. It's the line in on my GoXLR. I have my streaming PC sending signal from the line out of the streaming PC into the line in of my GoXLR. When my streaming PC is not on, it creates a ground loop 
and that creates buzz and that buzz ends up in your headphones. So if you mute this channel, the line in channel on your GoXLR when you're not streaming or using a secondary device, if that's not on, you just mute the channel and the buzz goes away. If you turn that device on, then it has signal to send through the line so the ground loop doesn't happen. So that's it. Just make sure that if you are using a two PC setup and you have a line out from your stream to the line in of the GoXLR, that that PC is either on or that channel is muted and you won't get buzz in your headphones. If you've been having a similar issue with your setup, I hope my video helps. Please comment below and let me know. Please like the video and subscribe for more videos like this to come. Cool dude out.